See, the country is now moving forward to become a major economy in the world. And one of the important factors determining that trajectory is mobility of people, for business travel particularly. So a distance of about 500 kilometers, you are able to travel within two hours. It's going to make a big difference. More importantly, imagine if you're able to travel that distance between Mumbai and Ahmedabad every 15 minutes. That is a paradigm shift. To be able to make a business travel every 15 minutes of the day, a train is leaving from one station to the other station and you can reach in two hours. That means you can leave in the morning, do your business, come back in the evening. And so this is creating a new paradigm of enormous business activity and potential, which was not possible earlier with air travel or road travel, because we had limited ability to travel like that. And that will create new opportunities now around the stations, because now it's possible if you're located near the railway station, you can reach the other destination so quickly. A lot of real estate and businesses will now locate near the railway station. So new business activities will come. We're already seeing that a little bit through the metro project development. After the metros have been built in major cities, we now see new real estate being developed, residential, commercial, and this will increase far more. And this is important for the common person to appreciate, experience, and reap the benefits of it. Countries like Japan, South Korea, and China have done this, and they have benefited a lot. We are now moving into this new era. This high-speed rail is like the new IT, or the new mobile phone revolution for our country.